Okay, there we are. I'm sorry for that, folks. We got cut off for some reason. Uh, I'm not sure exactly why, but uh, you may or may not be back with me, but I'm going to assume that you are, and so I'm going to continue uh, with our affirmation of faith, a new creed, and I invite you to say it along with me today. We are not alone. We live in God's world. We believe in God who has created and is creating, who has come in Jesus, the Word made flesh, to reconcile and make new, who works in us and others by the Spirit. We trust in God. We are called to be the church, to celebrate God's presence, to live with respect in creation, to love and serve others, to seek justice and resist evil, to proclaim Jesus crucified and risen, our judge and our hope. In life, in death, and life beyond death. God is with us. We are not alone. Thanks be to God. At this point in our service in the sanctuary, I would invite you to make an offering in response to all the good things that God has given you, and I invite you to do that now. There are many ways you can do that if you're on par or if you drop an offering envelope off at the church. Uh, during the week or in the box, but also if you go to our website, you can click on donate and it'll give you some other options as well. So uh, I want to end today by uh, making a challenge to you to think about how exclusive you are in your understanding of the Christian faith and of God's love and embrace of people. And I invite you to embrace everyone, to embrace all those who are in need, whether they're part of your particular understanding of who you are or not. Draw the circle wide, expand the boundaries, color outside the lines, all these things. And as you do so, may the Spirit of Christ within you reach out to all and be the fellowship of the Holy Spirit with you, be with you today and always. Amen. Have a great day, folks. Bye-bye.